Who do we have the pleasure of speaking with? Darius Mountain. Darius, how long have you been with Russell Speeders? It'd be four years on August 28th. Four years. Absolutely. Four wow. Years Can't go wrong. That's great. Um, when you started with the company, what were some of your intentions? To flip the store, to get it rolling. When I first started, it was like, a, where do I start? It needed a lot of screws. Oh, it needed a lot of screws tight. And we got it together and look where we at now. Took okay. some time, but we there. We ain't always there, but we get we get there. What was uh, what was your first pr uh, position with the company? MIT, uh, manager, manager in training. training right off the bat. Correct. Awesome. And um, with that going forward, was it always your intention to go into being a manager? Uh, I want to go to the top, even farther than that. Further than that. Yeah. Oh, okay. I love Absolutely. that. Um, baby. <laughs> uh, fast forward into today's present world. Where are you with the company? I'll be going into a new role as a um, store manager. Very very soon. And uh, which uh, which location is this Omaha area? Dodge. Omaha Dodge. And uh, uh, how do you like it? It's amazing. I love it. It's 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 a challenge, but we get in there. Um, the most thing I love about the place is my people, the customers, my employees. Um, without them, it won't be no me or no Russ Peters Omaha Five. Um, what would be uh, what would be some tangible advice and words of wisdom that you would like to give to somebody starting out and wanting to grow and gain more opportunity like yourself today? Never give up. Always look at the brighter side of things. Don't take things personal. Just keep pushing and you'll get there. Um, what's uh, one of your superpowers? Making it happen. <laughs> Making it happen? <laughs> Go get her? Okay. <laughs> so uh, like you said with... Um, just to fixing things and getting going along, like with the glamorous side of things. Um, let's talk about the bad, the ugly, the hardships uh, along the way. Can you uh, be a little uh, expressive about that and what that kind of looked like? Everybody hits roadblocks. So what, what did yours look like? So the bads of anything or just overall? Yeah, just like, you know, what, 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 what's, what stopped you or what made you feel like, hey, like I'm hitting a roadblock right now. I feel like I want to give up. I think, I, I think some of my roadblocks was um, what's the right word? Thinking I'm right all the time. It's, I just need to shut up and listen sometimes. So when someone tell me, okay, man, you took that the wrong way. It wasn't really intentional. Oh, taking things personal. Taking things I, personal. I feel like things, all of this my mind, but it's, I work for a company. But I feel like it's, I treat it like it's my own pocketbook. And sometimes take the best of me or even with customers experience, like how to, how to phrase things to them the right way without defending the customer. Hmm. But well, other than that, um, the goods, meeting new people, um, yeah. seeing people grow in their positions, um, seeing our member count grow. Mm. This overall, the total experience of Russell Peters five, I should say. I love that. And uh, how many how many team members do you guys have here at Dodge Street? Thirty nine. Thirty nine. Not all full time. Not all full time. Not all full time. <laughs> Not all full time. <laughs> <laughs> and then, um, do you have any hobbies outside of work? Um, I have a party bus business on the side. Um, I like to be with friends and family, my nephews. Um, I'm always looking at ways to make more money and to better myself in life. So with the, the party the party bus business, I'm assuming there's an experience that's tied to that. How, how do you incorporate that experience into here and then that vice versa into there? Good question. Um, this customer experience, how to treat people. Um, always giving them level five service like treat them like you want your parents to be treated when you go to a restaurant or how you want your parents to be treated by their husband or whatever the case might be um and the overall i think it's just overall customer customer experience like being there when you need them responding timely on time yes please and thank you and just going above and beyond what other bus companies uh other bus companies don't mm, i love that and then um do you have any big goals or things you would like to knock off the bucket list before 2022 ends? Oh, I have a lot of goals. Um, like get to 15,000 members, right? We're going to get over that. <laughs> that's our cap off. 15,000? That's, that's, that's achievable. Um, I would say a lot of my goals oh, have over nice guy, yeah. before the end of the year. Um, hopefully get the building behind us started. Hmm. My brand new house will be done in November. Exciting. Um, that's it for now. Man. Just keep grinding and pushing away. 
And then have you uh, traveled anywhere outside of uh, Nebraska? What are some go-to places that... Florida. Florida is your, Florida, Florida, Florida is your place. Yeah, I love Florida. Um, I'm going to Dominican Republic at the end of the year. I usually take about four or five trips a year. One oh, is wow. out of the country and five is this United States, you know? Love that. And then what is, uh, what's a piece of uh, leadership, that, uh, leadership advice that you would like to... Um, uh, discern and uh, pass on down to any upcoming MITs getting ready to step into a manager position um, as we grow and expand. So this is a huge one. Understanding your people. Yeah. Understanding people that work for you. You're not always right. Listen sometimes, like I said before. Sit back and listen to what they got to say. Because sometimes you can learn from them or vice versa. But most of the time, just sit there and understand your points. I love that. Yeah. And, uh, Darius, thanks. We're uh, we're super excited to have you and to see all your growth with the company and uh, going forward. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. You thanks. bet. He says that all. See, it wasn't bad at all, right?